a beautiful day here on the UNO campus and a great day for another Maverick Minutes. Hi everyone, I'm Dave Allers and thanks for tuning in. We're going to take a break from our usual updates on the construction at Baxter Arena. We'll have that for you next time. But what we wanted to do is give you an insight into what the student athletes do during the course of the summertime. There's jobs and those kind of things, but there's also uh, some special opportunities that come along every once in a while. The men's soccer team, for example, had an opportunity to take a nine-day trip to Costa Rica. While down there, they played games, they got a chance to see the country, a real eye-opener, and a great team-building experience. And here to tell us a little bit more about that is Jason Mims, the head coach of the men's soccer team. And Jay, tell us a little bit about how this opportunity came up in the first place. Sure. We, uh, we looked at our current roster of what we have uh, grade level and had to decide um, when would be a good opportunity for us to go on a trip like this because the NCA uh, allows you to take a foreign trip once every four years and looking at our current roster with the uh, majority of our players returning and a good nucleus we figured that this was a really good time uh, this summer to, to take a trip like this and we were fortunate enough to have some wonderful people help us with this trip and help us fund it and the administration was very supportive of it so we're very thankful of uh, having the opportunity to go to Costa Rica. It was nine busy days for you guys. In those nine days you played four games which is quite a competition schedule. Tell us about those games and the competition you guys were facing. Yeah, we had four games in about nine days, and I think uh, one or two games are enough in nine days, <laughs> but four games, is it was tough. But we were, uh, yeah. were fortunate. To, uh, we practiced a little bit before we went out there, and our fitness level was extremely high. The guys have done a great job this summer uh, staying fit, and we're very motivated by this trip. So uh, we got through the four games, uh, played four professional teams. We won a couple. We lost a couple. Had a great experience on the field when you get to play any professional team, but uh, the guys were pretty, uh, pretty motivated to play those games, so I didn't have to twist uh, too many arms to get ready. I bet. Well, Jason, thanks for your thoughts on that, and we should note as we shoot this, we are less than a month away from getting going, so I uh, can't wait to see you guys out here. Thanks. Dave, I appreciate it. Thank you. A couple of guys who can tell us more about their experiences down in Costa Rica are a couple of our seniors, Parker Victor and Josh Christensen. A great advantage for you guys to get a chance to play four games while you were down there, but a lot of team building off the field as well. And I want to ask you first about the zip lining, because that looked like a lot of fun. We have some video of that. Tell us a little bit about what that was like. It was fast. It was fast. It was uh, in the middle of a rainforest. You know, we took a gondola up. I think it was like 25 minute ride to the top of the mountain and we took, I think it was 10 different lines all the way down back to the base. So it was adrenaline rush that we needed once we played those four games and it was relaxing at the same time a little bit. As we shoot this, we're about a month away from the start of your season and there are a lot of tough games that you guys will have this year. I understand the, the whitewater rafting that you guys did while you were down there was perhaps some of the most physically demanding stuff you did while you were gone. Yeah, that's true. Uh, I was the only one in my boat to fall out. <laughs> out, of, out of all the seniors, of course, all I fell team. out. And of course, it was probably 30 seconds into the trip, so everybody got a good laugh on that. But that was actually pretty tiring. You know, we were rowing down a river for two hours, and then halfway we stopped and we were swimming in a waterfall. So. Well, I've got to think now, guys, as you look forward to the season, you're really hoping that you can start, you know, maybe at mid-season stride almost when you start playing those games in August. Yeah, it's a good jump for us uh, to get these early games and then come back and have, a, have another training camp before we get the regular season started. So it's good to see, to judge our fitness, um, to see where we're going our, where we are going into preseason, and we'll be able to get going pretty good. Well, Parker, Josh, thanks so much for, uh, for sharing your memories of Costa Rica. We look forward to seeing you guys out here on the field real soon. Yeah, thank you. And that's another edition of Maverick Minutes for this month. We thank you for tuning in, and we invite you next month to catch in with us again as we give you an update on the construction at Baxter Arena. Until then, I'm Dave Ollers. Thanks for watching.